Hello, hello, hola y bienvenido, mis amigos, my friends. Welcome to Family Storytime in Two Languages. So I'm just going to play a song while we get ready for storytime today. This is called Canción de Amor, which means Song of Love. And so we're just swaying and listening to this song. If you join us, you can go ahead and drop your name in the chat so that I can greet you by name. And so today's story time is going to be in English y en español, in English and Spanish, but you don't need to be bilingual to enjoy the fabulous time that we are going to have today. Welcome, welcome. So this song is kind of a swaying song, I feel. It's a good swaying song. I'm going to bring out one of my favorite friends to sway with me. This is a bird that we never get to use. I'll just show you how fancy this is. So we're going to sway together. So this is an emu. Look how fancy he is. Or she, or they, I don't know. Yeah. All right, so hello friends. I see you are joining me and my emu friend. And we're going to do our story time in English and Spanish. We're going to start in about one minute. If you drop your name in the chat, I will greet you by name. Welcome, welcome. Annabelle, hi! Hi, Annabelle. Hi! Oh, hola, Annabelle. It's so good to have you here. Welcome, friends. Bienvenidos. We are going to start in about 30 seconds, and I hope you are as excited as we are. Friends, if you have been with us before, you might have heard the announcement that we are going to be putting a pause on our virtual story times for the summer, but we hope you join us this Saturday for our last virtual story time for a while, which is going to be I Can Tell Black Stories. Are you excited? All right, friends, we are about ready to get started. I'm going to send my friend away. So, whoa. All right, let's go ahead and get started with our story time. Hello, welcome, welcome, bienvenidos, hola. I am Miss Becca and I'm going to be your storyteller today. And I'm so excited you're here. We're doing a story time in two languages, um, inglés y en español, in English and Spanish. And this is going to be on family love, amor familial. And so I'm very excited that you are here with me. And we're going to start right off with our open shut them song. And we're going to do a version that is by Crisscross Mango Sauce. And so this is open shut them and abre. Sierra. So let's start off. It starts off in English and then we're going to do it in Spanish. So go ahead and get your hands ready to do this rhyme with me. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Open, shut them, open, shut them. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Lay them on your lap, lap, lap. Breathe them, grow them, breathe them, grow them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. So that was in English, and now we're going to do it in Spanish, which is abre, open, cierra, shut, abre, cierra, all right? Oh, good morning, Morgan. I am so glad you're here. Get ready. Abre, cierra, abre, cierra, da una palma divina, abre, cierra, abre, cierra. It's open your little mouth. How wide can you open your mouth? Ah, ooh, ooh, that's wonderful. Pero no metas los dedos. Don't eat your fingers. All right, so now we're going to go baja, baja. job. That was open, shut them, abre, sierra. And so we have already spoken two languages this morning. Congratulations. All right, my friends. So today's story time is going to be about amor, love, and amor familial, family love. And I'm going to share books with you that I have never shared with anybody ever before. Um, 
And I thought the first book that we would do is called Only One You, Nadia Como Tu. And this is by Lydia Krantz. And the translation is by Teresa Mlauer. So I love the illustrations. And actually, I'll show you a non-shiny page of this book. And something fun about doing digital story times is that we would never be able to use a book this small when we're in person. But you get a front row seat. And that book is as big as your screen. Only One You, Nadia Como Tu. All right, that starts off right here. And I'm just going to show you the picture page. I'm not going to show you the word page. It's time, Papa said. Es la hora, dijo Papa. I think it is, Mama agreed. Estoy de acuerdo, dijo Mama. Time for what? Adri asked. Hora de qué? Preguntó Adri. Papa's voice softened. La voz de Papa fue apenas de un susurro. To share some wisdom. De compartir un poco de experiencia. All right, so if you're looking at this picture, you can see an adult. This is fascinating, too. I love this artwork because it has photographs of the ocean, and then the stones that are painted are put on top. So here is the wisdom from Mama and Papi. Always be on the lookout. Busca la oportunidad de encontrar for a new friend. Un nuevo amigo. And I'll zoom in and we can see our friends. Oh, they're so excited to be friends with each other. Look at that. Look for beauty wherever you are and keep the memory of it with you. Busca la belleza donde quiera que estés y guardala en tu memoria. You see the beauty of the clouds, the beauty of the sea. Blend in when you need to. And when you have the chance, stand out. Se parte del grupo, resalta cuando tengas la oportunidad. And so here on this page, can you see something that's standing out? Can you see two rocks that maybe don't look like the other rocks? Maybe that brightly colored rock or that one. Yeah, good eye. Find your own way. You don't have to follow the crowd. Encuentra tu propio camino, no sigas la corriente. Can you see a fish on here that is not following the crowd? One that's finding its own way? Do you see that one? Look at him swimming the other way. Know when to speak and know when to listen. Intuye cuando debes hablar y cuando debes escuchar. So if you see these rocks, each one of them, each one of the pairs has one that is listening and one that is speaking. Can you see which one of these is listening? Yeah, that's right, that one. And which one is speaking? Yeah, that one. What about in these others? What about in this one? Can you see which one is speaking? This one, yeah. And this one's listening. Good job. Let's find some more advice from Mama and Papa Fish. No matter how you look at it, no importa la manera de mirarlo, there is so much to discover. Hay mucho por descubrir. If you, make to, if you make a wrong turn, circle back. Si te equivocas de camino, retrocede. If something gets in your way, si algo se interpone en tu camino, move around it. Apartate y sigue adelante. Oh, we're going to do a song that uses the word adelante later. Set aside some quiet time to relax and reflect every single day. Busca tiempo para relajarte y reflexionar cada día. And here, I'm going to zoom in because I love that photograph that those rocks are swimming over, that coral. It's so pretty. Appreciate art. Aprecia el arte. It's all around you. Está a tu alrededor. It looks like a gallery under the sea. Make wishes on the stars in the nighttime sky. En las noches estrelladas, pide un deseo. Have you ever made a wish on a star? I have. I like to do that out camping. Thank you for listening, Mama said. We hope you'll remember. Gracias por escucharnos, dijo Mama. Esperamos que tengas presente. Papa winked and whispered, We know this is a lot for you to think about. Sabemos que es mucho para recordar, uh, dijo Papa con un guiño. Adri did a backward somersault and smiled. Adri dio una voltera en la aire y sonrió. He was excited to go out into the world with what he had just learned. 
había escuchando con atención los conejos de sus padres y estaba, oh, ansioso por conocer el mundo. All right, couldn't say that word for a second. Wait for me, he shouted to his friends. Espéreme, grita a sus amigos. And before he swam away, he turned back to his parents. Oh, sorry, I got off center for a second. He turned back to his parents and said, I will remember. Antes de alejarse nadando, se volvió hacia sus padres y les dijo, le recordaré. Mama kissed Adre on the top of his head. There's only one you in this great big world, she said. Mama depositó un beso en la cabeza de Adre. No hay nadie como tú en este inmenso mundo. Make it a better place. Haz de él un lugar mejor. And there they are. They're kind of making a heart. You see that shape. That's nice. You clap for that story. That is only one you. Nadie como tú. And that was a lot of Spanish. I hope you sat so well for that book. Um, okay, so let's go ahead and do a song, my friends. Let's go ahead and do uh, Mi Cuerpo Hace Musica. This is by Mr. Eric and Mr. Michael. And this is one that we love to do at our bilingual story time. So Mi Cuerpo Hace Musica means my body has music or my body makes music. And we are going to make music with our hands, with our manos. They're going to say clap, clap, clap. We're going to make music with our pies, our feet. And they're going to say stomp, stomp, stomp. We're going to make music with our boca, with our mouth. It's going to say la, 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 or la, la, la. You can do it however you want. And we're going to make music with our cintura, our waist. We're going to say cha, cha, cha. All right, let's do this song together. Mi cuerpo hace música. All right, so you can just get your body moving, find the beat. You can get stretched out. All right, mi cuerpo hace música. Mi cuerpo hace música. Mi cuerpo, mi cuerpo. Good job, I see movement. Nice. All right, so your manos. Mis manos hacen ta ta ta. Mis pies hacen ta ta ta. Mi boca hace la la la. So your waist hace cha cha cha. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right, and now we're going to do it in English. My body, my body makes music. My body, my body makes music. Your hands, my hands say, your feet, stop, 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 mouth, la, 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 waist, cha, cha, cha. Excellent. I like that cha, cha, cha. Mi cuerpo, mi cuerpo, hace música. Mi cuerpo, mi cuerpo, hace música. Mis manos, mis manos, hace la, la, la. Mis pies, hace cha, cha, cha. Mi boca, hace la, la, la. La cintura, hace cha, cha, cha. Excellent. We're going to do that again. You ready? Mis manos hacen ta ta ta, mis pies hacen cha cha cha, mi boca hace la la la, mi cintura hace cha cha cha, mi cuerpo, mi cuerpo hace música. Nice, good job. Oh, I love that song. That song is so high energy. So since we're talking about um, amor familial, family love today. And we've just read our longest book, which is all about parents giving wisdom to their children to go out into the world. The rest of the books are going to be shorter and very sweet. Um, I thought we were talking about love, amor, and I thought we would make a heart. Can anybody already show me how to make a heart? Can you? Ooh, ooh, some of you do. Okay, so we're going to do a rhyme real quick um, that lets you know how to make a heart. And it goes like this. I put my hands together. This is how I start. And then I curl my fingers round and I can make a heart. Let's do that again. I put my hands together. This is how I start. And then I curl my fingers round and I can make a heart. My heart's kind of lopsided, wonky. I, I can make a wonky heart. All right. So I'm going to do a rhyme with you guys called Little Red Heart before we do our next book. And this is about colors. And I don't know if any of you know your colors in Spanish or not, but we have a heart right here. And can you tell what color that heart is? That's right. It's red, rojo. That's right. So the song goes like this. Little red heart, I love you. I love you. I love you. Little red heart, I love you. And red heart says, I love you too. Oh, thank you. Let's do another one. Let's pick another heart. You might not have ever seen a heart this color. Can you tell what color that is? 
sometimes it's hard to tell on the screen, but this is a green heart. Let's sing our song about our green heart, Verde. Little green heart, I love you. I love you. I love you. Little green heart, I love you. And green heart says, I love you too. Let's do another color. This is Miss Becca's favorite color in the entire world is azul. This is blue. Little blue heart, I love you. I love you. I love you. Little blue heart, I love you. And blue heart says, I love you too. Let's do another one. Oh, this is a very bright color, a very happy color. Can you tell what color that is? That's right, it's yellow, amarillo. Little yellow heart, I love you, I love you, I love you. Little yellow heart, I love you. And yellow heart says, I love you too. Oh, sweet. Let's do one final heart. And this is another very bright color. What color is this heart? Orange, naranja. That's right. Let's sing our song together. Little orange heart, I love you. I love you. I love you. Little orange heart, I love you. And orange heart says, and orange heart says, I love you too. Good job, my friends. Thank you for singing along. Let's do another book together. This is called Nosotros Means Us, a bilingual story in Cuento Bilingue. And this is by Paloma Valdivia. And that is, if we're talking about amor familial, I'm going to think that that is a mama and a baby. And this is published by Alfred A. Knopf. So let us start this book, Nosotros Means Us, right here. Si yo fuera una oveja, if I were a sheep, tú serías un cordero. You would be a lamb. Si yo fuera una yegua, if I were a horse, tú serías un potrillo. You would be a foal. Si yo fuera un gran pez, if I were a big fish, tú serías un alevín. You would be a fry. I don't know if you knew that, but a little fish is called a fry. Ooh, do you know what animal that is? That's right, that's a bear. Si yo fuera uno oso, if I were a bear, tú serías un osesno. You would be a cub. Si yo fuera una topa, if I were a mole, tú serías un pequeño topo. You would be a pup. And I didn't know that a baby mole was called a pup. That's new information for me. Oh, I bet you know what animal that is. What is that? That's right. That's a coneja. That's a rabbit. Si yo fuera una coneja, if I were a rabbit, tú serías un conejito. You would be a bunny. Y un día te iría saltando. And one day you would hop away. And there's our little bunny. Hop, 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 hop. So this page doesn't have any words on it. ¿Dónde está mamá? Can you see where the mama is? Can you see the bunny tail? Mama está aquí. That's right. Mama's right here. She's crawling in a little hole. ¿Y qué está haciendo mamá? What is, what is mamá doing? She's still in there. And it's winter now. Ella está esperando. She's waiting. There are no words on several pages. No words here either. Espera más. She's still waiting. Más. Espera aún más. She's still waiting. Huh. Hasta que, ¿Qué pasó? What, what, what happened? Do you see anything? I'm going to go back a page. What do you see right here? Yeah, that's a mariposa. That's a butterfly. And on this page... Do you see? It's a cocoon that's starting to hatch. So that mama is waiting a very long time. Y volverías convertido en lo que tú quisieras. And you would come back, turned into whatever you wanted to be. So here now is the baby coming back. And it looks different. Para entonces, yo también habría cambiado. But then... I would have changed as well. So now mama went in as a bunny and is coming out as a bird. Y aunque nos viéramos algo diferentes, and even though we would look different, siempre seríamos 
mamá y hijo. We would always be mother and child. And there's a little bird kiss. Siempre seremos nosotros. We will always be us. And now at the end, our little baby is asleep. And so that is the book. Nosotros means us. Can you clap for that story? You did a good job. I've never read that book out loud before, but I think it's very interesting and has potential for conversation about many things if you would like it to. All right, my friends, it is time for us to do another song. And I thought we would do Los Niños Cuando Bailan, which is by Whistle Fritz, which is just a fun. Can you say Whistle Fritz? That's a fun band name. Whistle Fritz. It's just so fun. Okay. So Los Niños Cuando Bailan. And this has some body parts in it. So our kids are going to dance with their dedito with their finger, and they're going to dance with their pie. We already learned that word in the other song, their foot. And they're going to dance with uh, la rodilla, which is the knee. And they're going to dance with la cadera, which is the hips. You can't see my hips, but they're swaying. And we're going to dance with la mano, which is the hand. And we're going to dance with la cabeza, which is the head. And so we're going to add on all of those things. Los niños cuando bailan. All right, my friends. Oh, coming in hot. All right, let's find that beat. Los niños cuando bailan, 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 bailan. Los niños cuando bailan, bailan con el dedito, con el dedito, quito, quito. Así bailan los niños. Or you can do it with the other hand if you want. All right, now we're going to add something. Los niños cuando bailan, 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 bailan. Los niños cuando bailan, bailan con el pie, con el pie, pie, pie. Con el dedito, quito, quito. All right, and now we're going to add la rodilla, which is the knee. Los niños cuando bailan, 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 bailan. Los niños cuando bailan, bailan con la rodilla, con la rodilla, guía, guía. Con el pie, 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 con el dedito, quito, quito. Así bailan los niños. All right, and now we're going to add la cadera, which is your hip. Los niños cuando bailan, 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 bailan. Los niños cuando bailan, bailan con la cadera. Good job, my friends. And now we're going to add la mano, the hands. Los niños cuando bailan, 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 bailan. Los niños cuando bailan, bailan con la mano, con la mano, mano, mano. Con la cadera, 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 con la rodilla. All right, and this is the last one. We're going to add la cabeza, which is your head. Los niños cuando bailan, 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 bailan. Los niños cuando bailan, bailan con la cabeza, con la cabeza, esa, esa, con la mano, 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 con la cadera, 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 con la rodilla, guía, guía, con el pie, 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 con el dedito, quito, quito. Así bailan los niños. Good job, good job, good job. Oh, my friends, my wonderful friends. It is time for us to do a little rhyme since we're talking about amor familial. Um, I do a lot of love-themed baby story times, and I know we have a lot of preschoolers that watch us virtually, but if anybody's got a baby, what I would love, actually, I'm going to give you time to go grab a stuffed animal if you have a stuffy, and I'm going to have you pretend like it is your baby, okay? Or if you got a little brother, a little sister, you can do this with them, but I matched my animals behind me as a parent and a child. So here, for example, we have, do you know what animal this is? Oh, it's giving me a kiss. Yes, right, it's a sheep. And here we have our baby lamb that is with it. And I brought in my parent monkey and my little kid monkey. And what about this one? So I hope you're grabbing your stuffy while I'm doing this. You can watch this when you come back. So we've got our big pig and our baby pig. And then I have over on this side, oh, we got some twins. I'm not going to move them, but we have our oso, our bear and the two baby bears, ositos. And then here we have, we don't use this animal a lot. Do you know what animal this is? 
That's a kangaroo. That's right. And this is the little baby Joey in the pouch. So we're going to put that back. And then we have, I hope you're coming back with your stuffed animal. And we're going to do a baby rhyme after this. And then we have our turtle. Oh, she's looking kind of sad. Mama turtle, baby turtle riding on the shell. And the last animal that I'm going to show you is we have our bunny, our mama bunny, and our baby bunny. So I brought a whole bunch of animals and their kiddos today. And I thought we would do a bouncy rhyme. And I'm going to use my goat as my baby. And this is just a bouncy rhyme that lets you love on a kiddo and also lets you, lets me, Zerbert, a goat puppet on camera. So that goes like this. It's called 10 Tiny Fingers. So you're going to find the fingers. 10 Tiny Fingers and 10 Tiny Toes. Find those toes. But one tiny belly button. Round and round it goes. And sweet little ears. Oh, that's a horn. Can you find the ears? Yes. And a sweet little nose. But one tiny belly button. And that's where mommy goes. <gasps> and you Zerbert, your animal or your infant, whatever you have. Let's do that one more time. Ten tiny fingers and ten tiny toes. But one tiny belly button. And round and round it goes. And find your sweet little ears and your sweet little nose. But one tiny belly button. And that's where mommy goes. <gasps> That's right. That's one of my favorite rhymes to do at a baby story time. I absolutely love it. Um, all right, my friends, we have time for one final book and then we're going to do open shop him and we will be done. This is I Love You Baby Burrito and this is by Angela Dominguez and it's published by Roaring Book Press. So I Love You Baby Burrito and I actually just found this last week, but it was published in 2021. I just missed it. I Love You Baby Burrito and it goes like this. Hola, bebe. You're finally here. Mi dulce, mi sweet. This is your home, tu casa, where we promise to keep you safe. And so even though it is the human mommy telling the story with the daddy and the baby, there are other animal parents in this book. Maybe you can spot them as we go along. And we're your parents, tus padres. We are so pleased to meet you. This is your delightful carita, which I think looks just a little bit like mine. And these are your precious manitos. And we learned la mano in our last song. So a manito means a little hand. These are your precious manitos and deditos that I could gobble up. Deditos we learned in Abre Sierra. That means fingers or toes. Speaking of, are you hungry? Tienes hambre? Oh, I thought so. Much better now that you are contenta. And some gentle pats on your back might help too. Oh, ay, perfecto. Well, you have had a big day, un gran día, the first of many. And here is our human family and our bird family. Now it's time for a siesta. So let's wrap you up, my precious gift, mi regalo. With cozy, suave blanket, I tuck in each piernita and each bracito. Your piernita means a little leg and bracito means a little arm. I tuck in everything except that carita, which on second thought might look more like your papas. Mi hermosa, my beautiful. Did we mention we love you? Oh, we do, muchísimo. Buenas noches, mi baby burrito. The end. And as with a lot of Angela Dominguez's books, we have that glossary of words. So, oh, I love that book. I love you, baby burrito. Thank you for letting me share that book with you. I've never shared it with anybody before. Well, my friends, we've reached the end of our story time. So we're going to sing open, shut them together. And I'm going to do silly open, shut them because that is my favorite thing to do. And since we're taking a pause from our virtual story times for the summer, it might be a while before we get to see each other again. So get your hands ready. And adults, I'm going to try and trick you too. I'm going to be so tricky. I'm going to be super sneaky, Miss Becca. All right, get ready to try and follow me if you dare. Oh, open shut them. Ooh, nice job. Oh, open shut them. 
Give a little tap, tap, tap. Nice. Oh, pinch at them. Nice. Oh, pinch at them. Lay them in your lap, lap, lap. No, that's not my lap. That's my nose, me and Let's try that again. Lay them in your lap, lap, lap. Is that, is that my... That's not my lap. That's my back. Silly. All right, let's try it again. Lay them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, crawl them, creep them, crawl them. Right up to your chin, chin, chin. Open up your little mouth, but do not let them in, in, in. Creep them, crawl them. Creep them, crawl them. Right back down again, again, again. Oh, pinch them. Oh, pinch them. Now our stories must end, but we're going to sing Abre Sierra in Spanish real quick. You ready? Turbo fast version. Abre Sierra, Abre Sierra, down a palmadita. Abre Sierra, Abre Sierra, mantén las juntitas. Sube, 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 sube hasta la barbilla. Abre la boquita, pero no metas los dedos. Baja, 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 baja otra vez. Abre Sierra, Abre Sierra, historias terminamos. Most and we close our book. Good job, my friends. Thank you so much. So, just to remember, um, our story times are going to take a break for the summer months, and our last Facebook story time is going to be this Saturday with the I Can Tell Black Stories um, story time. And so, we hope that you join us and that you check out all the wonderful in person and online programs that we are having at all of our library branches. So, go to cmlibrary.org/calendar for more. We have loved seeing your faces, and we are so grateful you have continued need to show up as we have. So bless you and we will see you very, very soon. Bye.